This procedure begins with sectioning 8 micrometer liquid nitrogen vapor frozen tissue blocks on a cryostat set at minus 17 degrees Celsius onto plain uncharged glass slides. Thereafter, the sections are stained with the histogene staining kit. After identifying the pyramidal neurons, the cells, about 500, are laser captured onto the HS capture cap. The cap, with cells, is placed in a microcentrifuge tube containing 50 microliters of extraction buffer, turned upside down, and placed in a falcon tube previously positioned in a rack seated in a water bath set to 42 degrees Celsius. After a short centrifugation step, the cap is removed. The remaining solution is then ready for RNA isolation. Hi, I'm Shemaine Peterson from the laboratory of Wilson Wu in the Department of Structural and Molecular Neuroscience at McLean Hospital. Today we're going to show you a procedure for laser capturing pyramidal neurons from human postmortem brain tissue. We use this procedure in our laboratory to study differential gene expression in the superior temporal gyrus of schizophrenia subjects using microarray technology. So let's get started. Brain tissues were obtained from the Harvard Brain Tissue Resource Center as liquid nitrogen vapor frozen blocks. Prior to tissue sectioning, it is important to reduce RNA's contamination. All surfaces, including the work area, sectioning blade, and slides,